Good morning, guys. Let me say good morning. This little guy just got up. I am uh, getting some morning stuff done. Oh, that's right. I cleaned the kitchen up a little bit and while my coffee was brewing. And um, I got up and I did not take a shower, but I washed my hair. I'm going to just open the door up because it's really nice outside this morning. And just let some of the cool air inside. So, I have got my coffee this morning. And I'm going to... It's coffee. See my cup? I love my cup. Uh, I'm going to sit here and nurse this baby. And uh, read some of my Bible and drink my coffee before the other kids get up. Um, it's... It's about 10 till 7 right now, and they're all still snoozing, which is good. So uh, that's what I'm doing uh, for this morning. So today is Saturday, and tomorrow is Father's Day, and it's also our anniversary, and we went yesterday on a date um, out for lunch and just to hang out for the afternoon. Um, so tomorrow, after church, my husband has a jail ministry, so he'll be at the jail all afternoon. Um, and then on Tuesday is my husband's birthday, um, and half of our children will be gone to, um, their grandma and grandpa's house. They have a uh, vacation Bible school. Really, you're talking to mom. So half of them will be gone on his birthday. Um, so tonight I have planned a dinner, um, kind of a surprise birthday party for my husband that he doesn't know about. Um, I've on I only invited one set of our friends because I didn't want to have this big thing and I uh, have to cook a bunch of dinner and stuff. And so. Um, and I know he's going to be tired because he's at work today. So I just invited uh, one of the families that we uh, enjoy hanging out with. And they're going to come over about 5 o'clock for um, dinner and um, playing games tonight. So um, the kids will be excited about that. I'm not sure if I want to tell everyone that we're doing that. <laughs> I did tell two of the kids um, yesterday. But uh, I don't know if I want to tell everybody because my husband will get home at 2.30 and I don't want them to ruin the surprise. So we'll see who we who I tell. But this morning, um, after everyone gets up and we get breakfast and everyone's dressed, we're going to go over to, we're going to run over to Walmart and get him a Father's Day birthday present. Um, I think we're going to do that. And... Um, and then we'll come back and get our house cleaned up because it's pretty uh, messy. Just needs some tidying and organizing and wiping things down. But, um, yeah, it's kind of a mess from being my husband being off and being gone to the lake on Thursday. And just uh, getting stuff ready for that and making a mess of the house. So that's our plan for today. This guy is mobile now. He cruises all over, don't you? <laughs> he get into everything, huh? He's just about nine months old, and he's started pulling up on stuff, too. He'll stand up on things. Yeah, you do, huh?
All right, I'm getting some breakfast this morning. We're gonna have smoothies. I've got milk, some uh, plain yogurt, some mangoes I'm gonna pick through, protein powder. I've got one frozen banana and some frozen blueberries. So I'm gonna throw this in. For our family, it takes two, um, two of these. So I'm gonna blend up the first half and then I'll do the second half. I also added some spinach in there, frozen spinach I had in the freezer. Okay, go ahead. where I keep my some of my food okay I just found a pair of socks stuffed back in there that somebody had tried to hide there and forgot that that's where they put them and I always am finding random things like that all right so this is I'm getting ready to make um, cheesecake for our dessert tonight I'm gonna start by making the crust I have some graham crackers, and then the other things that you need for this are whipped topping, sugar, cream cheese, and then I'll get some butter out to make my crust. And I also have this um, red raspberry seedless puree that we're going to use to put on top of the cheesecake with raspberries. And then I just went out to our strawberry patch, and I picked these strawberries, so I'm going to clean them up. Um, so we can have those on top of cheesecake also. While I'm waiting for our um, cheesecake crust to cook in the oven, I'm going to get some carrots peeled and sliced up into my crock pot to cook for dinner. I got my crust finished. 
for the cheesecake. I'm letting it cool and then I'll make the filling. And then for our carrots, I finished chopping them and then I put them in the crock pot and I mixed up about uh, two thirds cup of butter and I melted it and I put in about a third of a cup of honey with some salt and pepper and um, basil and I dumped it on top and stirred it. Now they're just gonna sit in there cooking. So now the kids are working on a craft, making cards for dad for birthday and father's day. Just a minute. And I am cooking some macaroni and cheese for them for lunch. And I'm just having a salad with some leftover chicken on top of it. All right, so we've got a big pot of macaroni and cheese here for the kids. And that's our favorite and kind. Of course, it's homemade. All the macaroni and That's what they're having. Clayton's eating some of these sweet potato fries that are left from yesterday. And then him and I are also going to have some taco soup with my salad. I ate some of my salad, but it was hurting my teeth a lot because it was so cold. So I put the lid back on it and put it back in the fridge. And now I'm just going to eat some soup with Clayton. Alright, we had some visitors my mom and my sister came and um, hung out with us for a few hours and they're leaving now so I'm gonna get my meat um, cooked and put in the instant pot I have this pork loin roast okay thank you and I'm going to brown it in some oil and then I'm going to brown it in this oil and then I'm going to put it in my instant pot to let it cook. Alright, we've got this in here browning and I'm going to put some of this roasted garlic and herb seasoning on here. Alright, so I'm getting this browned in here and I'm going to get a little bit of water in the bottom of my instant pot. Can you stop putting that in here please? I need to find my Grace. It goes in the bottom of the pot to put my meat on. And I just stepped in water. They dropped the ice cube. And then I'm going to see if I have some Worcestershire sauce. Now I'm making some rolls to have with our dinner. And my carrots are looking really 
really good. All right, my pork roast is done in my Instant Pot. I've got the rolls rising in the oven. You can see them in there. And then my carrots are actually done also in the crock pot. So we're just waiting on the rolls to finish rising and then I'll get them baked. But right now everyone else is outside and our friends are here. So I'm going to um, tell you all goodbye for the day. Thank you for hanging out with us and watching. I hope you enjoyed my video. Please give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed my video and I will talk to you next time. Bye.